as of June 30th, 2020. A total of 506 civilians shot and killed by police. 105 of them being black, of course. In 2018, there were like 996 total police shootings. Black people have the highest rates than any other ethnicity to be murdered by the hands of authority. Now it's the month of July and police shootings are still increasing. At the same time, looter sneakers are still ceasing increasing. But can you blame us? They try to frame us and then tame us into oppression from adolescence. And you wonder why we're so aggressive. Why you're still possessive. I'm talking financial and economic slavery. Let's acknowledge the bravery of our indigenous people who founded America. Not Chris, oh, I mean Christian Columbus. When Columbus sailed that ocean blue in 1492, there were still 1,400 men and women being held in captivity. I bet most never even had a clue. You're too worried about how many Andrew Jacksons you have in your pocket, man. Google the Trail of Tears. We're talking hundreds, thousands, maybe millions of Americans being slaughtered by other Americans after they stole our faith and used our babies as alligator baits. I mean, there's nothing different from what's going on in the world today. Hey, we live in the United States of America, all oh, the irony. Let's not forget about those public servants that pull out that iron, see? When he pulled that black man over, he didn't know what to do. That pig skin made him feel like a giant, so I guess he thought this Mac could do. What else I'ma do besides try to free you while they're still financially free? Free to tweet what he wants, make racist remarks, grope married women, and their private parts. I mean, it's always been like that from the start. So I had to start analyzing the alliances of this supremacist just to realize that the analogy of the atrocities are all from the atmosphere of his anarchy. Man, I wish my boy Dominic was here with us right now because he'll be right there on the front line trying to dominate. But hold on, you're gonna get saved today because one of us has to pave the way through faith and praise so Breonna Taylor can start singing Amazing Grace. It's time to put out an APB on the Kentucky PD, see? You killed a queen, an EMT. Oh, that's TMI, Karen? You must think that we care enough about what you think because that man put his knee to his neck and didn't even blink. 846, that's for the next eight birthdays a father will miss in exchange for the cop getting six years. Man, my people are sick. And I'm not just talking about Corona. We're sick of our people going to the corridor. We just want to walk through the corridor of justice and peace. But we get no justice, no peace with racist police. That man died jogging in the streets. They wanted Ahmaud Berry seven months into the year now of the rest of people's lives. How can we change each other's lives one step at a time? I use my words to educate my kings and queens, the new generation, no matter the gender of gentrification. Take it back to our African roots all in the month of June. June, June, June. White fear violence from us. We do not have a history of killing white people. White people have a history of killing us. And what you fear, it is a deep guilt thing that white folks suffer. You are afraid that if we ever come to power, we will do to you and your father what you and your people have done to us. And I think you are judging us by the state of your own mind and that is not necessarily the mind of black people.